Dabbing King. Tank your ankle so bad, make your moan. It's your boy, the Dabby King, back here. What I'm gonna be showing you how to get some sharpshooter badges. So, the first badge I'm gonna be doing today is Deep Range Dead Eye. Now, sharpshooter, this badge is very helpful in part. It helps you make contested jump shots. Um, you can hit anywhere. Um, so basically, what you gotta do for this badge. Oh, and one more thing. What you wanna do. This badge is helpful because, say if you need a three. Somebody come in your face and you shoot it deep. So that is why this badge and Limitless Range badge is helpful to get. So as I'm about to show you my badges right now. All the badges I've got. I'm still working on the um the Sharpshooter Pro badge. Now the Pro badge is not as simple as it is, but it's not as hard. So, um, yeah, man. So, let's get into the video. Alright, so we're um, in my court. Um, later on in the day, I'm going to be doing on how to get the jump shot creator. And I'm going to be giving you some good jump shots that you can use. And um, 2K17. Right now, I have on James Harden. Yes, I said it. James Harden. James Harden is a great three-point shot if you want to use in part. It's all buckets all day. Sometimes you might get green bean as you see that. So uh, let me show you my badges. So yes, this is my dude. He's a 87 six five sharpshooter. So, um, let's see. As you see here, I have four Hall of Fame badges. Catch and Shoot, Corner Specialist, and here it is. Deep Range Dead Eye. And Limitless Range. And these are the rest of my badges. Now, as you see, I do not have the Mid Range Dead Eye. Mid Range Dead Eye is actually not required. The badge is unirrelevant. But if you would like to have it, if you are if you are a trash mid range shooter in park, you might want to need that badge. Just saying. And, uh, these are some of my attributes. Uh, matched out three, um, agility almost, rebounding, playmaking, defense. And you see, my mid range is trash, but in park I don't take mid rangers. So, so let's get into the game. Sports pregame show presented by Kia. Welcome to the NBA 2K Sports Radio Council here with my colleagues, Ben Fiorio and Peyton Fitzgerald. We're bringing you the Houston Rockets out of Toyota Center as they face off against the Phoenix Suns. For the Suns, it's been all about winning games right now. 
They must be satisfied with the way things have gone for them over the first few months. They've played with confidence and composure and have won more than their share of games. And Eric Bledsoe, one to watch in our game tonight, just a force to be reckoned with out there on the floor. Jack, he's a guard who does it all. Yeah, I always talk about the guards, which I'm a big guy, but this guy with the great rebound on his side, he rebounds. So, you see, um, uh, skip this. Oh my god. Oh no, we have two white jerseys. Big mistake. So, as you can see, I play for the side. So, this is all you want to do. Uh, rock and roll, da da. So, this is all you want to do. First, you want to get a seal. This is helping you with pit pocket. So you want to get the steal. Well, you don't get a steal. You get a rebound. Call for the ball. This is all you want to do. You want to roll over here. And you just want to pull the three. Oh. I just feel I didn't hit it. So, or you can have Justice pass you the ball. But as you see these people talking about, go to the, um, uh, free throw line and all that. That that, that just makes it harder. Cause sharpshooters, they're really not. Unless you have a good mid range. Some sharpshooters don't worry about mid range. So what you wanna do is you wanna spot up like right here. Call for the ball. Pump fake. Till he come up. Shoot. That's all you wanna do. As you see this year in 2K, the the mid um the um deep range the dead eyes won't show up as a bad so if you don't see it you still doing it as long as your dude does this if he does a fade away like like that you know you're doing something good you know you're doing something good so this all you want to do let me show it one more time he got it all right so this is all you want to do want to spot up right here Pump fake till he come up. Uh, that's all you gotta do. If you know your dude, that's not to do right jump shot and he fade away, his fall, do any fade away animation, then that's how you know you're doing the badge to the right. So now I'm gonna show you the clip where I got the badge. And yeah. So for bronze, you're going to need. Um, about a hundred to you gonna need a hundred to a hundred and fifty contested deep range shots and for Hall of Fame you're going to need about two to three hundred contested jumpers and yes that's it